now it's time to purge. Now this will probably be the most difficult part of the process for most of you. Now is the time to make a decision on what you keep or what not to keep. That might be tough for many of you, but let's get started. Again, we're working with our sorted closet. So all of our top skirts, dresses are in all together. I would strongly suggest that you do that first, which is why the sorting process is first, so that you have all of the similar items together, which hopefully will help you make a better decision. Another point of advice, do not agonize over your decision. If you're not sure whether you want to keep it or not, keep it. Come back to it later. All right? So let's get started. I suggest that you touch every item. Most people assume that, oh yeah, I want those. Not a good idea if you want to purge out your closet. For some of you, a lot of this stuff you haven't seen in a long time, which is why I suggest you touch every item. Again, think quick. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, no. Yes, yes, yes. Mm, no. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, mm, maybe. So maybe you want to set that aside. But this is the process you would use. And again, the same process would be used with every category of your clothing. So now let's look at a purged closet. Now let's look at some key teaching moments. Hopefully the process wasn't as tough as you had anticipated. The purging process began with touching every item. Again, some of the things that are in your closet, there's been a while since you've seen them. Think quick. Don't agonize over your decision. If you're not sure, then just set it aside and decide later. Invite a friend over to help guide you through the process. Step away when it becomes difficult and stressful to make a decision. Set flexible parameters as to what factors are going to influence your decision. It may be that you haven't worn it in a while, or maybe the color never looked good on you. There could be a myriad of factors that would influence your decision. So don't make it tough. And lastly, once you're comfortable with your decision, and you have a complete purge pile, then schedule a time to have your donations picked up right away before you change your mind. Our class assignment is to upload a photo of your pile of donations and giveaways. I would love to hear how you were able to make your decisions. Was it a tough experience? Was it not as stressful if you, as you had anticipated? And as always, all questions and feedback are welcome. In addition, if you would like a virtual session with me, please don't hesitate to let me know. I would love to work with you. We have successfully completed two thirds of the organizing process. I hope that you are enjoying tackling your closet thus far. So now, Let's review our course outline. We've set the atmosphere. Music always makes a process a little more fun. We've taken time to sort, separating our clothes into various categories. We've had time to purge, to decide whether to keep or not to keep. And now we've saved the best and my favorite for last. It's time to organize. We're gonna put everything in order. I hope that you have enjoyed your journey thus far, and I'm looking forward to seeing you next time. Bye-bye for now.